innovations really are driving the technology right into the center of our lives. I still believe that the computer business is in its infancy, that there's a tremendous amount more, uh, a tremendous amount of innovation that's going to be coming out. Uh, I'm optimistic as to the future of the computer business. I think when you actually see one of these things, you're going to just be blown away with how beautiful it is and how thin it is. You like everything so far? Well, I'll try not to blow it. It's amazing. And, and, and the, the market's never had a consumer product this powerful and, and this cool looking. We believe it's a platform. We believe on that platform you run standard-based software, a wide variety of software. Databases and application development tools, and, you know, a variety of guest operating systems running on the virtual machines. It's a comprehensive development and execution environment that could run virtually all of your applications. It must be virtualized. It must be elastic. It clearly it includes both hardware and software. And we have a slightly different take than Amazon.com in that we believe that not only are these clouds going to be publicly available to lots of different customers, but we think individual customers will have their, build their own private clouds behind their firewalls. And we call those clouds also. Sure. Well, thank you very much for that question, because cloud computing, uh, the, the interesting thing about cloud computing it is either going to be or already is the most important computing architecture in the world because we've, we've redefined cloud computing to include everything that we currently do. So it has already achieved dominance uh, in, in the industry. I mean, I can't think of anything that isn't cloud computing uh, with all of these announcements. I have to say that the only way I can understand the computer industry, the computer industry is the only industry that's more fashion driven than women's fashion. Uh, you know, I mean, cloud computing. I remember I was reading W and I found a read that orange is the new pink. And cloud is the new SaaS. Uh, or, you know, in cloud is a new virtualization. It is the most nonsensical. I mean, I read these articles, I have no idea what people are doing. No, maybe I'm an idiot. I have no idea what anyone's talking about. I mean, it's really just complete gibberish. Uh, cloud computing is Google Mail is cloud computing. Okay, and then uh, and then Mark Benioff says SaaS is cloud computing. Uh, I mean, what is it? What is it? Is it? Oh, I'm going to access data on ser a server on the internet. That's cloud computing. Well, then there's a definition. What's cloud computing? It's, it's using a computer that's out there. That's one of the definitions. I mean, the computer that's out there. These people who are writing this crap are out there. They're insane. I mean, and the fact that, I mean, you read, it, it's the stupidest. Uh, look, I've been mean, through this. I mean, open source. Open source is going to destroy our business. Well, there'll be nothing but open source, and we're, we're out of business. But if it was PCs, we're going to destroy, destroy main, many computers are going to destroy mainframes. PCs are going to destroy many computers. Open source was going to destroy stand, stand, standard. Everything was going to be delivered. All software is going to be delivered as a service. When is this idiocy going to stop? I've been at this a very long time. There are still mainframes. That was the first in industry that was going to be destroyed. And watching mainframes being destroyed is like watching a glacier melt. I mean, even with global warming, it's taking a hell of a long time. I mean, what the hell is cloud computing? So, you know, I don't, you know, whatever. We'll make our, but, yeah, but we'll make cloud computing announcements because, you know, if orange is the new pink, we'll make orange blouses. I mean, I'm not going to fight this thing. But, you know, well, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, fine, we'll do some, well, maybe we'll do an ad. Uh, I don't understand what we would do differently in the light of cloud computing, other than mark, you know, than change the wording on some of our ads. It comes down to trying to expose yourself to the best things that humans have done, and then try to bring those things in to what you're doing. I mean, Picasso had a saying, he said, good artists copy great artists steal and we have you know always uh, been shameless about stealing great ideas um, and I think part of what 
made the Macintosh great was that the people working on it were musicians and poets and artists and zoologists and historians who also happened to be the best computer scientists in the world.